In this tutorial, we will learn how to convert solid part into sheet metal using two methods. At first, we will see how to use this convert to sheet metal and then we will also see how to use this rip and insert bends. Click on this convert to sheet metal. Then at first you will have to specify the fixed entity. I want to fix this bottom face. Then you will have to define the bend edges where you want to apply the bends. I want to bend apply bend on these edges. Select the edges for the bend. And wherever there will be two bends, the rip will be added automatically. And from here you can specify the radius, default radius for the bend. And from here you can reverse thickness direction. Whether you want it inside or outside of your solid body and if you want to specify different radius at different position you by clicking on this you can specify the different radius and it has collected the repages automatically then from here you can define the corner defaults which type of corner you want whether you want open but overlap now it is open but whether you want it overlap like this or underlap so it will be over the other and from here you can give the gap how much gap you want as for that this gap will be controlled suppose but and gap of 1 and here you can define the ratio overlap ratio how much you want then from here you can define the k factor or other parameters that you want for your sheet metal part and here you define the relief which type of relief you want it and if you want to use gauge table by clicking on it you can use the gauge table also and click on ok in this way this part is converted to sheet metal you can flatten it and see the flattened part this is the one method and other method is suppose if you have some shell part suppose here we will apply the shell here you can specify the thickness for the sheet metal how much you want suppose I want sheet of one thickness then remove the face suppose I want to remove this bottom face and click on ok now this is a shell part I want to convert this shell part into sheet metal the other method is you can use this rip to specify the rip edges click on this rip then specify the rip edges I want to rip on these four edges then here specify the gap how much you want point for you ok now here rip is added but this part is not converted to sheet metal to convert this part into sheet metal you will have to apply this insert bends click on this insert bend then give the fixed face here I want to fix this face and specify the other parameters what is the bend radius then what is the k factor then auto relief and gap for the rip then ok then click on this ok so here this part is converted to and auto reliefs are automatically applied and you can flatten it so in this way you can also convert a shell part into sheet metal using these two option and using this you can roll back to no bend condition click on it it will roll back to no bend condition and again click it it will give the bends back that's all thanks for watching we will stop here